Here is a starfish. It is one of nature's most fascinating creatures. Today we will be dissecting one. Let's first take a look at the top, or the aboral surface. Right here you can see the madreporite. The central section where the madreporite is located is known as the central disc. Each of the five arms are known as rays, or arms, you can decide. The small white projections are known as spines. The purple area in between, you see, is the skin gills. Now let's look at the bottom side, or the oral surface. In the center, we can see the mouth where the starfish expels its stomach to digest its food on the outside. Along each arm, we can see the ambulacral grooves, which are filled with small tube feet. Now take your scalpel and cut off a segment off one of the arms, or rays. If you look at the outer layer, you can see that it is hard and white. That is a calcareous plate. Now take your scalpel and cut along the middle of both sides of one of the arms. Lift up the top flap of the arm, and you can see the large brown digestive glands. Along the bottom, you can see the gonads. The white ridge you see is the inside of the ambulacral groove, made up of ambulacral ossicles. The purple grape-like things to the left of it are the ampullae. Now use your scalpel to cut off some of the remaining arms for better access to the central disc. Inside the central disc, we can see one large organ, the stomach. If you remove part of the stomach, you can see the stone canal extending down from the madreporite. The stone canal connects to the ring canal. 